Okay, so we travelled through Greece and we made our way to Ada's farm, which is in the middle of central Greece, maybe like two hours um, north of Athens. And she's like this badass 60 year old woman who's living on a self sufficient farm, solar panels and stuff. Um, and she's teaching us a lot. And um, hopefully, you'll get to see a bit about how she lives, her motorbikes, her chainsaw, her shotgun, that kind of stuff. So, me and Ada are getting water. It's from a borehole. How many meters deep? 70. 70 meters deep. Nom, 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 nom. Yeah, yeah, come on. No, it's horrible. Yep. So we're playing Scrabble and Ada's going to kick our ass. <laughs> we're going on holiday to Athens with Ada. Lads on tour, lads on tour, lads on tour. We're the train. With a train, with a train, with a train. Okay, so we made it to Athens and we're now walking through a flea market with this little junk people buying. Then later on, our way to an Anarchist festival. <laughs> Festival water. So I'm here with Steve and Smart from the LGBT community in Athens. Hi guys from Football, we just want you to know that we're part of the international family and we're sending love. They get in! Come on! So this is how things work in Greece. We're outside the van eating his dinner on the floor and a man comes over and gives us some crates to sit on. So in return, we give him some olives. Then, in return for that, he gives us some pickled fruit. So we give him some rakia. And then, in return for all of that, he gave us a load of Turkish delight. So, well done Greece. Look at the dog beetle going for it. Whee! <laughs> it rolls down there. Bye! <laughs> <laughs> so she runs sliding down the side of Mount Olympus. <laughs> Put it like here. We climbed mountain. As you can see on my bump bed. <laughs> Seven hours <laughs> of walking. About eight really. My hands are a different colour to my face. <laughs> It looked like Neapolitan ice cream. Mm -hmm. 